Hi everyone, this is Catherine. Thank you for tuning in. Welcome back to Room 3. Um, depending on how much um, I've got um, to left to go to for this um, game, this may be just a continuation from the previous um, video. So let's just jump right into it. Um, we finished the pre the, we finished the um, the last chapter in the last episode, so the last video. So let's just continue on and see how we go. Okay, there's no. Hopefully, there's no audio or recording. Um, mix-ups this time and we'll just um continue on yeah okay Alrighty. so here we are we're at the end of the previous episode um we've got the pyramid um thing so i'm guessing we go back to the back to the original room put it in the now where do we go back? I think we go back in here, which is the elevator. Yep. Okay, so we're gonna go down and see what this next one holds for us. Pretty fast elevator. Alrighty, so we're gonna go out here. Now I think we go uh, here. I can never remember where to go. Yeah, here we go. All right. So I think there's a place where we haven't gone to before. So I'm just going to put that there. Hopefully this isn't the last one because I really want to continue on. I really want to keep going with it. Okay. Um, cool. Craftsman's key. Alrighty. Ah, the one place we haven't been yet. Easy. So we've still got four items. So I think. Loading. Ooh. Uh, this is the model from, from one of the previous episodes. I'm not sure whether it's a model anymore, though. Alrighty. So, oops. So, that opened up. So, I'm guessing we need to get what's there. What have we got here? Craftsman's key. Can we manipulate that in any way? Oh, yes. What's this? Um, can we move that? We can't move that. Oh, it's a button. No. Okay, there's a couple of things on it, but it doesn't look like we can do anything with it yet. And what's this other thing we got? Screwdriver. Okay, so that's the only. Whoop. Nope, that's the only panel there that we can do anything with. I wonder if we can move that there. Hmm, okay. Right. Another thing to do with astronomy, I guess? Maybe? What's this? Uh, so, screwdriver. Nope, so we can't. Change that or move that around, okay. Right, so there's a panel on the other side that we can't manipulate, but we don't want to worry about that yet by the looks of it. It looks like a... S Hang on. No, 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 no. What's this? Okay, what's in here? So I can't do anything with this yet okay now what has that changed 
this? No, it hasn't. Okay, so can we do anything with that with the screwdriver? No. Okay, so going like that. We can't unscrew that, can we? No. Okay. What about... Oh, it's a chair. Or something. Or a mirror? Maybe. Hmm, okay. Hmm. Right. Oh, trapdoor. What did we go up that trapdoor? I can't remember. What's this? Oh, what does it say? The box opened up. What is sitting on the edge? Well, that, of course. Hmm, okay, so... So we can't... Can we? Well, we know that that's sitting on the edge, but what is it? Ah. No. What is sitting on the edge? What if... We go like that. There's something in there. No, see that goes straight there. I don't know. So that has no hint. Sitting on its edge, so what box? Talking about this? Or that? So we can't move that up or down, we can't move anything like that. Move that. We have to be able to do something with this. We can't manipulate that. Hang on, what did that? do anything. So I think we know where that goes, hopefully. Yeah, okay. Okay, here we go. I don't know what's in here. Oh, okay. Okay. 
Okay, so I think we need to... Again, looks like a telescope as well. Okay, cool. Interesting. Alrighty, so. Okay, so that's being powered by a laser. Laser goes through here. Okay, so I can't go through there anymore. Interesting. Okay, but that doesn't have anything to do with it. Or does it? Can we move that anywhere? Can we move this anywhere? A light beam projecting from the tower. I wonder if there's a way to redirect it. Okay, so. Ah. Maybe. Did that change? Hmm. Oh, hang on. I wonder if this has got anything to do with it. that. That. Ah, okay. Right. Okay, cool. It's one of those spinning things. Wait, is that getting darker? It's getting darker over there, isn't it? Ah, so I need to... There we go. Mirror. Okay. Okay, so the mirror goes here, maybe? goes up here. And if it goes in here. Yes. There we go. So we move this like that. Alrighty. It sparkles again. So I'm just checking the time every now and then to see
I like puzzles. Easy to work out. Okay, so did something. Hmm. Oh, that looks interesting. Insert something. No. Okay. Oh, we've got two towers. Right, so I'm guessing we need to have something going there. Hang on, is that look? Can we move that up? What about this tower? Okay, I've got a couple of lenses. Alrighty, so let's just go here. First case. Oh, we're on the train again. Okay. Congratulations, you have found the centre of my labyrinth. That that way feel like that may feel like a victory but it leaves you further from freedom than you have ever been if this is any consolation you are the first you will be far from the last know that every single turn led you to this point as you like puzzles so much i find i have one final riddle for you to occupy your eternity what is the difference between a maze and a labyrinth but how can I expect you to answer when you cannot tell room from prison? What's the difference between a maze and a labyrinth? Huh, yeah, okay. Maze and a labyrinth. Is that where we were? Wow. Okay. Okay. Congratulations, you completed the room three for the first time and witnessed the aftermath of your actions. However, there are alternate endings for you to discover. You can now choose to change your fate button on the main menu to receive Grey Home. Only by visiting mysterious artifacts, using the mysterious artifacts hidden in the craftsman, will you earn the power to alter your destiny. Oh, very interesting. Time four, five hours, 24 minutes, 10 seconds. Okay, well that was the room three. I hope you enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. I love these, um, love these games. I might use the choose your fate option next time and then another playthrough. Um, now this game, Fireproof Studio, is absolutely brilliant. I love your games. The Room series is a fantastic series for those who love puzzle games. And as you can see, it gets quite in depth into um, to basically using your mind to work out. And some of them are really, really tricky. And they get um, more and more tricky as the game progresses, which is what I absolutely love about puzzle games. The mechanic of, of the, the puzzles getting more and more harder as the game progresses is a great mechanic, mechanic for puzzle games. Um, yeah, um, if there's a fourth one coming out or if there's another one coming out, I'm, like I said, I'll, I'll use the change of fate option on the next playthrough I do. Um, so I hope you enjoyed that. Um, do go out and check out the other games. The Room series is absolutely fantastic. And you start from the beginning, get an idea of maybe maybe it's all in your mind. And what is the difference between a maze and a labyrinth? No idea. Anyway, I'll leave that with you. And I'll leave that for now. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.